Hello and welcome to the new Kerbal Space Program series, Colonial Kerbals. As you can see, this is for the updated .24 with contracts and reputation and funds, since apparently that's what they're going to call them now. As you can see, we have nothing in our science tree except for Tier 1. And with this, we are going to do not only science, but we're going to do contracts and reputation as well. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So Gene Kerman wants us to do launch a new vessel. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, we can do that. Um, let's set an altitude record. And we're going to hold off on escape the atmosphere for right now. Mostly because I don't think we have enough in the sources of uh, life support and deadly reentry stuff to get us back safely as of just yet. As you can see, we also have a uh, new, uh, new tabs up here. This one lets us know that our contracts have been completed. And this one tells us what current contracts we have. So we need to get up to 5,000 meters, and we need to launch a new vessel. So let's do that. Oh, as you can see, the flag we're going to use, if you've ever seen Mystery Science Theater 3000, you'll know what that symbol is. That's the Gizmonic Institute logo. I thought it was quite funny to have. Nice big green G on the side of the craft, and green with kerbals. Okay, as you can see, we also have our different things here. Our attack life support, which tells us what we have, how much we can take and have outside that ship. Okay. So let's see here. Let's just make simple little craft. And we'll call this one uh, Alt Runner. Because it is. That should get us well over to 5,000 meters and be our first craft that we launch. So here we go. First things first, ah, science alert, crew report, keep that, EVA, keep that, take the data, and store the data. Get back inside, what do we got now? Okay, apparently it's not acknowledging that we have that already. So, with our SAS on, and our, our tab for our science tree open, and KData, which apparently likes to drop down just out of sight here, I don't know why. But with that, let's go ahead and in 3, 2, whoa, you know what? How about we do this? <laughs> Wasn't even paying attention to staging. All right, in three, two, one, go. Take that crew report. And we'll just go ahead and acknowledge that. that one. And this should get us up to... Uh -oh. Oh, 
that would be a PR nightmare to get out. <laughs> I thought I'd just pop that up there. And back down we go. Oh boy, that's probably a bad thing. <laughs> oh, I forgot to turn on permadeath. Hopefully this is the only thing that explodes. And then our heat shield should be able to take up the rest, I hope. Okay, back down we go. No, up we go. <laughs> we almost made it to orbital velocity. That's pretty bad. Oh boy. Let's see what Jebediah can see out of his crew window. Okay, now we should start going back the other way. As you can see, I do now have enhanced nav ball. Makes it a little easier trying to find my way around. I don't think we'll be going down that fast to have to worry about heat, though. I could be wrong, though. We will have to wait and see. Oh, I just realized that uh, Chatterer hasn't been going off. I'll have to remove all the or move the files back around for it. <laughs> we'll get that EVA report before we go back down too far. So note to self when doing deadly reentry, don't don't put a second booster on. It's not really needed. And down, down, down. Let's go ahead and just physics warp up a little bit. Through the clouds. Okay, like I figured, we should be safe from deadly reentry heat. And there goes the parachute. And that's slowing us down fairly quick. Oh, yeah. And, oh no, can't see through the clouds. Can't see through the clouds. There we go. Clouds make a nice blink on my screen. And, which is kind of funny, is that we're way over here and KSC is over that far. Okay. Hmm. I don't really need that panel open. Um, the one mod I did get rid of, in case you were wondering... I got rid of uh, Keythane, mostly because I found a different program that works with the Colonial mod a little better, and I just figured Keythane was too much, plus the creators of the uh, modular Kerbal or Colonial system is going to be releasing his own 
uh, resource mining kit. So once that's up and running, I will install that instead of the uh, ORS system I have. Okay. Nice and gently. Don't blow up. Don't blow up. Oh, it blew up. Well, let's get an EVA report. Keep that. New report. Oops, cancel. Take that even report. Take all the data out. Get back in. And we will recover. So what did this little mission end up granting us? It granted us a whole whopping 39 science. Not too terribly bad. For parts, we ended up with 999.73 funds. So now we're up to 18,502 funds. Not too bad. We got 97.8 for not being quite at KSC. We would have gotten more had we not blown up our solid rocket booster. And of course, we get 25 rep for Jebediah returning, so our rep has went up to 47. Which means now we're in the green of part of reputa reputation. So with that, I'm going to actually work on getting... Uh -huh. Let's see here. Test this parachute while flying over Kerbin. Huh, weird. When I got this the last time, I didn't quite get that. I got something a lot less than that. Solid rocket booster. Okay. Stacked coupler. And then we have Escape the Atmosphere, which I probably could have did, and Orbit Curve. But these will be for next time. For right now, let's go in here, and we'll take a look at the parts that we have. First you'll notice, this here, the Universal's uh, Quad Storage Compartment. That's right, I have Universal Storage, which means that this will make up a nice section. Also, some new decouplers. Which is for the heat shields, I believe. Also, our fuel tank. So we'll go ahead and spend our five science there. Let's see here. What do we have? Well, we have our life support. And our external oxygen tank from Universal Storage. So we'll go ahead and get that one. And we will also get this. And the reason I'm going this route first is that I actually want to get probes next, but I can't do that until I have 45 more science. So, we'll probably start doing another launch here in a little, in another episode. But for right now, I'm going to call this an episode even though it's kind of short. If you liked the episode, please like, favorite, and subscribe. There will be annotations as normal in the end. And until next time, guys, have fun.